My brothers and sisters, we are on number 48 out of 117 scriptures in the Old Testament that every person should know. So let's go and look at Job chapter 1, verses 6 through 8. Job 1, verses 6 through 8. And let's look at how God had this very special understanding of who Job was and how the Hasatan or the Satan did not notice that. So let's go to chapter 1, verse 6 in the book of Job. And it says, Now there was a day when the sons of God came to present themselves before the Lord, and Satan also came among them. The Lord said to Satan, Whence have you come? Satan answered the Lord from going to and fro on the earth and from walking up and down on it. And the Lord said to Satan, Have you considered my servant Job, that there is none like him on the earth, a blameless and upright man who fears God and turns away from evil? Now, What's important about this verse is that God noticed exactly who Job was. He noticed his great character, that he was an upright man. He turned away from evil. He feared the Lord. He was blameless. And his response to Satan when he comes into his presence is, have you considered him? Have you noticed him? In other words, God did notice. God did consider who Job was. And this is something that should encourage you as you live the faith because a lot of times when we live the faith, people don't notice the things that we do for Christ. They don't see how much love we have for our Lord. Most of our works and actions for Christ go unnoticed. People don't notice those things. But God notices all of those things that you do for him. So I, I want to encourage you to just look back and see how the Lord, he knew Job well. He knew this man would be able to endure excruciating trial and pain, and, and he considered him. And so, even when Satan came into his presence, he said, have you considered my servant Job? You think you own the earth? You think you've seen everything? You haven't, because you haven't considered who Job is. So as you live the faith, my brothers and sisters, don't worry about if you get attention. Don't worry about if people notice you. Worry about one thing, that God notices everything that you do.